We're in it. We've bought the uh, Black Rock Continental Competition Rod down today. It's a 15 foot blank. Um, it's a beautiful bit of kit. Uh, made more for the British market, so it's a little bit more powerful rod, but it has got a nice bite indication tip. If we move up the rod to the tip section here, so if you could just show it there, I'm going to pull the tip wet section round. You'll see it's got a nice, nice bite indication. It's got a nice soft tip action for that rod. All right, so you'll see that's going to show bite. That's going to sit in the tide nicely. It's going to show bite, uh, show bite from fish, hopefully. So what we're going to do, if we come down to here, we're going to see, I'm going to put a, a two-hook Portsmouth dropper rig, all right? So if you look down here, this is a two-hook Portsmouth dropper rig. What this does is the bottom hook drops off. It's a loop rig. You can see the loop there. That just folds away when it casts. This bottom hook will drop off and fish tight to the seabed on a long flowing trace, obviously, moving with the tide, which is what we want. We've got a nice tide running today. So hopefully we're going to see the, the rod pull around in the tide. Um, and we've got a two-hook rig. So we've got a nice long... Uh, top trace and a nice even longer flowing bottom trace but it's clipped up for distance casting so we're going to clip it up that'll all come unclipped when it hits the water uh, and then it'll sit nicely in the tide and hopefully we might catch some plays with some other fish on it we'll see. so we're going to put it on cast it out and see how we get on Right, we've cast the rod out now. As you can see, um, I think we've just done a lovely bite then. The rod's pulling around in the tide. So our first cast of the black rock. You can see it's got a nice bit of a tip action there. Pulled round in the tide, there it goes. And you can see that rod moving. There's a fish on the end of that. We've just had a nice pull. Probably a place, I would think. There's quite a lot of place about at the moment. Um, but if you can see that tip, hopefully it'll pull again. You can see that, there we go. Look, it's pulling in the tide. Very nice. So. Fingers crossed, um, all being well, we'll pull this rod in in a minute and hopefully we might have a place, possibly even two on the end, you never know. Okay, right, we've cast out our black rock. It's been sat out in the tide for about 10, 15 minutes now. We've had two or three really good pulls. Um, so we're gonna wind in and hopefully see what's on the end. got something on, nothing too massive but um, it's got a nice bend in the rod, in the tip section I can feel it bending slightly nicely so it feels like we've got something on the end there so I'm just going to continue winding in and then see what comes out. Right we're nearly in now, we've been winding in, definitely got something on here, it'd be interesting to see what comes out, I can just see my leader coming up now something pulling so we're just going to get closer to the sea if we get right close to the water we walk down from there there we go let's we'll see what's going to come out oh there's something on the top there we are look at that a double shot a place one nice plump place on the top hook and a small undersized place on the bottom hook two hooks two fish not a bad start for the black rock continental saw the bites get too nice 